Hey guys, what's up? Today is another helpful tips. This is Quick Time X or Quick Time Ten helpful tips number two. I hope to uh, keep a series of these so to help you guys out. But th today's video, this is going to be showing you uh, how to zoom in on a clip. As you know, uh, call outs is that's what they call when you like zoom up like, something like this uh, in ScreenFlow and stuff. You add a call out and it'll be like slowly coming in, so you can zoom in and stuff. And one way is uh, c hitting control and then zooming in. Uh, if you're on a laptop on your trackpad, you hit, you have two fingers and then zoom in like this. And then you can just like, if you're showing a dock, you can pan around like this for your dock. Um, that's one way. And another way I'm going to show you is a bit more, uh, is a bit more different. Uh, and it's, I, th I think it's much better. And this way is, if you, f say if you forget to zoom in, uh, you just record this. You think it's screen flow, and you can add a call out and zoom in, and you actually forget to, like, uh, zoom in like this. And th tell you guys, this is not the clearest uh, zoom in ever, so if you want to get a clean zoom in, all you have to do is another thing, I'm a Leo 9. So what you're going to do is you're going to get a recording of uh, screen capture. Um, so you're going to get it, and I have one example here. This is a video I'm going to post. On my other channel, Flynn and Nickel. So here is a clip. This clip is uh, it's cut off a bit. You can crop that, just fit, and then that's gonna be fine. So now you hear see the full screen. Say you want to get it close up, right around here, because I'm not doing anything on the bottom. I'm just showing the time machine back there. So what you want to do is hit crop, and then hit the crop button. And you see blue out uh, a green outline here. Grab it from a corner, and zoom it in like this. Once you have that, you're gonna hit done. Then, as you see, and from the twentieth, which is the last, it just records that area. That's the what. That's a way to zoom. Or if you don't want the whole clip like that, get the raw format. Select a part you want to zoom in. Go ahead and select that. And once you have that here, you can just. Uh, oh, my bad. Wrong one. Wrong one. You can just ah uh, keep on. Just go ahead and crop that, and you can go ahead and show us a bigger area, if you would like. So I'll show you like this. And I'll tell you how long it actually uh, took. That was pretty sucky for that. Uh, since this video might be long, I'll just cut back. So as you see, guys, it, it's two different. It's like call out, except you're not going to be, it's not going to be moving. It's just going to be like uh, uh, f flat. It's not going to be too like nice. You can, uh, you can add a transition in between. It might make it better. I'll tell you how long it actually uh, took. So it looked a bit better with the cross dissolve. So that's what I would use. Cross dissolve looks very nice. So that's basically it, guys. Um, it's a tip number two. It's how to add like a uh, a zoom in and like a call out in iMovie. So yeah, I have to do is have iMovie own eight or own nine. Thank you for watching. Comment, rate, and subscribe.